Welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg, and that is a 1968 GTX. Yeah, there's a 440 under the hood, and this baby's been on the rotisserie, so the bottom side is just as pretty as the top. Let's take a look, man. I tell you, the gold on it is really popping in the sun. All the metallic in the paint's looking sweet. The grill's looking good. The chrome on the front bumper's looking good. Love the blacked out hood. We're gonna get under the hood here in a minute. It's got a 440 under there. As you look down the side, she is just as straight as an arrow. Absolutely beautiful paint job. Now this car was done in 2012, which is good news because we know if there would have been any problems with this paint job, they would already be uh, rearing their ugly head. And the paint job on it is looking sweet. We got some beautiful door panels there. All the chrome's looking good. We got great looking steering wheel, center console. We got seat belts in the front and rear. Of course, you can see it's got bucket seats in it. She is one beautiful machine. Headliners looking great. Dome lights working, even the courtesy light and the uh, center console's working. The dash itself's in beautiful shape. The door jams are looking good. I mean, just everything about this car is off the hook. As you look down that big, long quarter panel, beautiful workmanship there. She's looking good. We got great looking chrome back here. All the trim back here is also looking good. Looks like it was bought at Key Chrysler Plymouth. Remember back in the day when they had put that uh, tag on the back of your car? Now you can see she's got a spare tire in there and look at all the paintwork in here. Everything just looking sweet. Wheel wells are looking good. Now, whenever you uh, got a car that you're looking at, make sure you pull up that mat and see what's going on under there. Look at that. Nicely painted trunk floor under there. Everything looking good. As you look down the side of it, passenger side's looking just as sharp as the driver's side. Just absolutely beautiful. Now here at Vanguard Motor Sales, we do not do any consignment whatsoever. So that means we spend the time, check these cars out before we buy them. We get them here to the shop, we put them up on the lift, that way you can see the bottom side and we can inspect them and answer every one of your questions when you give Tom a call. Here we go, let's take this baby for a ride. All right, earlier in the video, I guess I called this thing gold. It's actually bronze. I believe the correct name is turbine bronze. She's looking like gold though, baby. And you're gonna win gold with this baby. She is sweet. Now there's kind of a unique story on the motor. Um, the motor is off one digit, uh, the third to the last digit is one digit off. So either somebody replaced the motor with a motor that was just 200 units out and or they made a mistake at the factory. Of course, all the dates line up and everything. So we do believe this is the original motor. And if you can see that we're backing up, we got a traffic jam here. So you can see reverse works just fine. And we're going to take a little shortcut here around the traffic jam. Here we go. And don't forget, we can deliver this baby anywhere in the world. You just call Tom at 248-974-9513. He'll tell you just how easy it is to park this dream in your driveway. Now, all 
Also, if you need help with financing, we've got help with that also. We've got several bankers we work with on financing. Tom can help you out with all of that. Now we've got power outages all over the place here in Michigan. That's why I think there's a bunch of people cutting through our subdivision because the traffic is like rush hour in here right now. Now you can see down here on the dash how nice everything looks on the dash. Now all the buttons have fresh chrome on them, the faces, the gauges, all the lenses on the gauges, everything just looking sweet as can be. Now don't forget, we're going to put this thing up here on the lift here in a minute. We're going to show you how nice the bottom side is also. The previous owner uh, was, the reason he was selling this car is because he's looking at getting a 71 Hemi Cuda. So that would be a super cool project. I said earlier, this thing was restored back in 2012. And it has, I mean, it looks like it was restored yesterday. So my compliments to the restoration team on this baby. Now we're going to head back to the shop now and get it up on the lift so you can check out the bottom side. And if you want to go to our website also and check out the pictures, we've got about 100 pictures of the car. And you can see the rest of our inventory on our website too at vanguardmotorsales.com. And make sure you follow us on Facebook and subscribe to our YouTube channel so you get a notification every time we post a new video like this. So we're pulling into our shop now. We're here at 15100 Keel Street in Plymouth, Michigan. So stick with us. All right, we're underneath this baby now, and man, it's pretty under here too. Looks like a fairly new tank, fairly new exhaust. Um, and then the floorboards, I mean, of course, they're, they're probably from 2012, but they're definitely new. You can see the shackles are new, the floorboards are all painted, everything looking great. Um, we do have air shocks on the car, we got brand new brake lines, looks like brand new parking brake cable also. Um, 742 case on the rear end, and right around a 30, uh, 330 gear in it. Um, and it is a sure grip. You can see the Flowmaster mufflers. You can see all the great looking paint work on the frame. You can see the floorboards are all painted up looking good. They're all seam sealed up looking good also. All the nuts, the bolts, everything looking good. We got a crossover in here. We got a 727 Trans. That's a three-speed automatic for those of you who don't know that. It is date code correct, but it is not numbers matching. Now the motor we do, I told you the story when we were driving it. We do believe that the number is uh, the motor is uh, numbers matching because of that one digit off. I can't imagine that this motor blew up and somebody found the motor that was right behind this car, you know, only one digit off. So more than likely it was probably a swap at the factory. Um, the backing plates look good. Uh, we do have disc brakes up front. We do have drum brakes in the back. Um, we do have new sway bar bushings here. They've painted up the lower control arms and the sway bar, or not the sway bar, but the radius arms here to make them look like bare metal. You can see the uh, closeout here is all painted up looking good. The chrome on the bumper is looking good. It looks like these tires are definitely brand new. See that? And then up front, we got some uh, 255 60 15s. Wheel wells looking good. Bottom side of the rocker also looking good. The pinch weld looking good. Looks like our uh, fuel line and vapor line are brand new. I still see paper tags on there. I see brand new nuts and bolts there on the uh, back side of the torque box. Uh, looks like the spring packs also built up new. Um, out back here, we got some more traction. We got 275 6015s out back. And of course, Magnum wheels, and they also look brand new. We're going to lower this baby down and take a look at the 440 under the hood. All right, under the hood here, we got our Super Commando 440. Now, on a 68, the uh, stamping is right there on the back of the block, right where the trans meets, right in the middle on the top. Um, and we have taken a look at that. You can see the exhaust manifolds are stock. They've been painted with some high heat paint. You can also see that the uh, it's got power brakes set up on it. It's got power steering on it. 
Looks like a brand new diehard battery with a shutoff. Looks like it does have a Chrysler radiator in it. We do have an aftermarket cooler here for the trans. The alternator also looks like it's a rebuilt unit. You can see that all the paint work in here is looking sweet. The paint on the motor, the inner fenders. Uh, the body tag is here. Um, you can see that even the electronics look like they're new. Um, just everything's looking pretty. That firewall is nicely painted. The shocks look like they're new. I see new bushings there. Um, just everything's nice and neat, tidy. All the wiring's nice and neat and tidy. I mean, we got new insulation on the bottom side of the hood. We got new paint on the bottom side of the hood. They've restored the latches even. I mean, they did everything to this car. She is a beauty, guys. So she's a 440, she's a 68, she's been on the rotisserie, she's been done for a while, so you know she's gonna look good for another lot of years. Keep this baby in the garage, keep her clean, keep a nice cover on it, and you're gonna love it. Of course, I don't like putting covers on because I like looking at the car, so leave the cover off, just dust it off every now and then. So give us a call at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales park this stream in your drive.